What up everyone, it's your girl, Superwoman. And I have to kind of whisper because it's late and my parents are sleeping and if I make noise and my mom wakes up, she's gonna beat the crap out of me. No, literally, like my tati will come out. For those of you who don't know what tati means, it means duty. So this video is long overdue and don't get me wrong, I love me some pritter. But there are some people on Twitter that just need to calm their panties, okay? Because right now, their panties are LMFAO. Just right there. You just need to bring your panties down to an Adele, okay? Although, although I guess you wouldn't want your panties rolling in the deep, right? What does that even mean? It's provocative. No, it's not. Gets the people going. I'm sorry, you can click on subscribe now. Just kidding! No! Then do it. Don't wake up. So welcome to annoying people on Twitter. I know you couldn't see it, but I just did an epic pelvic thrust. I went Can you see it? I did like... I did like a, a promise, it was straight Babu Deva. First of all, I don't understand why anyone would follow those annoying accounts on Twitter that just point above and below, making a statement about the person. You know those accounts are just like, oh, the person below this tweet drinks the sweat under Rick Ross's boobs. Or like, the person above this tweet would strip for French toast. Like why? Why would people follow these annoying accounts that just expose the truth? Like honestly, that's between Rick Ross and I. And even- Oh my- Is my mom awake? And even more annoying than those accounts are the people who will screenshot those tweets and be like, Hey, Superwoman, look, it says the person below this tweet got raped by a midget, and you're the person below the tweet. Ha, 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 slapping me. Shut your face, okay? Honestly, no wonder you watch my videos, because you have a terrible sense of humor. Also, rape is not a joke. Also, okay, he wasn't a midget, he promised to take me to the chocolate factory, and we're both consenting adults, okay? So mind your business. Mind your business, I, I just, 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 just mind your business, eh? Right? What up, Fresh Prince reference? On top of that, it's rarely anything positive, so you know what, no, stop. I'm gonna start my own trend. Comment below, comment right now, okay. The person below your comment, okay, is a sexy piece of cherry cheesecake, and the person above your comment is so hot that their soap melts in the shower. That's right, go ahead, comment, tag each other, how fun. Let's talk about hashtags for a second, okay? A hashtag is a way to create trends, okay? To categorize a tweet and to put ending thoughts to your sentence. So there's no need for you, you, I'm looking at you, to hashtag every single word in your bloody tweet. I say bloody tweet because once I see your tweet, I'm going to slap its face. Like why? Why? All I see are signs. All I see are number signs. Your tweet has more number signs than the effing phone book. Like why do you need that many hashtags in your tweet? It's like hashtag I, hashtag love, hashtag you, hashtag, hashtag, what, what, what? Like ants could have a tic-tac-toe tournament on your tweet. Please, chill the F out. People who believe in fake accounts. Can I just talk to you for a second? Hello, Miss Bieber's wife for life, okay? If you are Bieber's wife, why do you think Justin Boober on Twitter is really him? Why do celebrities have verified accounts? Why do we have the check mark? Why do we have check mark for fun? Speaking of check marks, check yourself before you wreck yourself because I can assure you that Drook, Niley Cyrus, and Rihona are not the real people. Hello, hello, your brain is stupid. People who tweet you, okay, and then someone replies to that tweet, and now they're both having a conversation, but they're still tagging you every single time they tweet, so now you can see their whole conversation that has absolutely nothing to do with you. I wish I could remove my butt cheeks, okay, FedEx them to you, so you could just give them a little, just a little kiss right there, and then express post it back to me. You are very annoying to me, like, do you do this in real life? Do you go, hey, yo, Lily, come over here. Lily, come stand here. Let's hold hands. <laughs> okay. Awesome. Anyways, Jessica, what's going on? Hey, Joe, I'm super. How are you? I'm actually pretty terrible. I broke up with my girlfriend. Oh, that's okay. She was a slut anyways. That's true. Like, why am I here? You are forcing me to eavesdrop, and now I have no choice but to retweet your tweets so everyone knows about your slutty ex-girlfriend. You see what you're doing here? You're forcing me to be a bad person. Lastly, the most annoying people on Twitter are all those people who, for some reason, are not following me. Uh, what are you doing? Follow me. Follow me right now. Right here. At I, I, Superman, I, I what up shameless plug tweet me right now saying hello my name is blank and I'm a cupcake do it right now 
As for me, that's it. Make sure you rate, comment, and click that subscribe button. And I know a lot of you are going to comment below saying your video is late and it's Friday. Well, you know what? You're mean and you're a bully. But that's okay. You know why? Because to someone out there, you are a sexy piece of cherry cheesecake. I make new videos every Monday and Thursday, but sometimes I'm late and it becomes Friday. So we one love Superman. That is a wrap and how's it going? I hope you enjoyed that video. Click here and watch my last video. My Facebook and Twitter links are right there. You can also click the subscribe button for new videos every Monday and Thursday. I just want to point out the fact that I bought a new hat and I really like it. Are you ready for it? Okay, bye.